Ariel Hawani in Tokyo for UFC 144 alongside Kid Yamamoto who meets Von Lee this Saturday night at the Saitama Super Arena in Saitama, Japan. Of course, I say this Saturday night. It's actually this Sunday here in Japan, but this Saturday over in the United States. And Kid, thank you very much for the time. Um, how special is it for you to be able to come back to Japan and fight here once again, now this time in the UFC? UFC I'm really happy to have another fight in UFC, especially here in Japan. It's really happy and twice as happy as me. Uh, were you at all afraid that after your second loss in the UFC that you might not get another chance to fight in the organization? Yeah. I think I understood that. He said yes. Another chance. Why do you think they gave you another chance? I don't know. <laughs> I understood that as well. He doesn't know. Well, let me ask you this. What do you think went wrong for you? Like, why haven't you been able to, to pick up that big win in the UFC thus far? Lack of training because of the injury. That's the only reason, I guess. What injury did you sustain? Secret. Secret. Okay, I can respect that. I remember after your first loss in the UFC, you said that you were considering going to the United States to train here uh, in order to learn, you know, how, how the sport is uh, is played out, so to speak, here. Or I shouldn't say here, over uh, in the United States. Did you do that? Did, did you actually go out to the United States and train over there? Canada. Uh, Actually, not the States, but I visited Canada to have a training camp. My home country? Yeah. That's where I'm... Toronto. I went to Toronto. Which gym? Uh, Mecca. Mecca gym. And uh, was it beneficial? Do you think it helped you yeah. uh, advance your career? Yeah. yeah. And uh, so now uh, you're facing Vaughn Lee. What do you know about Vaughn? And what are you expecting to see from him when you fight on Sunday? All around. Uh, he's all rounder. He's good at standing. He's at good on the ground. Also, grappling is kind of good as well. But uh, it'll be good. It'll be fine. Do you consider this fight a, a must-win for you in order to stick around in the UFC? Do you have to win on Sunday? Yes, of course. Your English is very good. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Um, uh, and, and I'm just wondering, you know, uh, everyone has been talking, you know, since we've been here about the UFC's return to Japan and sort of the rise and fall of MMA in Japan, what, what happened. W what do you think needs to be done in order to get the sport back to where it once was from a few years ago here in Japan? Mm. I'm not promoter. <laughs> no. Promotion, good promotion. Mm. Do you think the UFC's return can help get things back on track? Yeah. あの、だ、ま、日本の人が世界のあの、MMAに目を向ける you know, be a big chance for Japanese MMA fans to take a look at UFC, which is uh, top to top in the world right at the moment. So, I believe this would be resume the popularity of mixed martial arts arguably one of the most popular Japanese fighters right now. Have you sensed the buzz here? Are people coming up to you telling you that they're excited to see you fight in the UFC? Have you noticed that there's excitement here for the UFC's return? UFC <laughs> Unfortunately, popularity of UFC is not very well at the moment, so actually it's opposite. Not people asking me for UFC, but I promote UFC to the Japanese fans. So, you know, since he's not fighting in Japan anymore, most of the people think I'm retired. So, you know, I'm appealing that I'm still here and uh, still fighting for UFC and UFC is coming to Japan. Final. Pay-per-view is not a 
you know, the difficult thing about EFC is you know, we don't have that kind of culture to buy pay-per-view channel here in Japan. So it's kind of difficult for us to see UFC fight on TV here. Uh, final question, who is the lucky lady that kissed you on your neck over there? It's <laughs> It's a, just a tattoo. Just a tattoo. No, no, no one did the thing? Oh, okay. That would have been nice. Good story. You should tell someone. No? <laughs> Alright, well, thank you very much for the time. Arigato and uh, good luck on Sunday. Thank you.